As IPL 2021 gets set to resume in the UAE, let's look at the Mumbai Indians who started their 2021 campaign in typical, trademark Mumbai Indians fashion. They, at the time of the postponement, sat on that fourth spot in that points table with four wins and three losses. But the one thing that will give Mumbai Indians fans a lot of joy is knowing that Rohit Sharma at that point was their leading run scorer in the tournament. 250 runs, he was batting at the top of the order, giving them solid starts, laying the platform for that middle order to come in and explode. And the kind of confidence and form he has gained in England, albeit in a different format, will only help him in the UAE. With the ball, Rahul Chahar starred for the Mumbai Indians and how picking 11 wickets, but that aside, his guile, his deception, he made it very difficult for the batsman to read him. And the pitches in the UAE are only going to suit that bowling, perhaps even more. But the Mumbai Indians also have problems. That middle order of Ishan Kishan, Hardik Pandya, Krunal Pandya, they haven't fired so far in this tournament. But this is Mumbai Indians. They start late and the fans would hope that come the UAE leg, those three start firing as well. Talk of firing though, the one man, the one player to watch out for, for the Mumbai Indians in this part of the season, will again be Kyron Pollard, because he is their rescue man. Before the season was called off, in their last game, he pulled off a heist against the Chennai Super Kings. He does it with the bat, he does it with the ball, he does it in the field, and sometimes when Rohit is absent, he also captains the side. His form in the CPL has been great and he will be a key again for the Mumbai Indians come the latter half of IPL 2021. CSK and Mumbai Indians go head-to-head -head in MI's first encounter after the resumption of the tournament. They play a host of other games and then end their campaign on October 8th, playing against the Sunrisers Hyderabad. Another thing that is all set to go Mumbai Indians' way is they don't like change and they don't have any changes in that squad. No opt-outs, no players missing out. They have that entire squad to choose from and that familiarity will only help them grow further. The last time they were in the UAE, they beat the odds. They won the trophy in an even year. This year, there's another record in sight. A hat-trick of IPL titles. Something that no IPL team has done ever. But these uncharted territories are MI's favourites. Can they go ahead and do that? It's going to be so interesting to watch.